What's up guys, this episode I wanted to talk about how you can have your users connect multiple OAuth accounts so they could log in with Twitter or Facebook or Google or whatever it is that you want, but have those all connected to the same accounts and how we structure our OmniAuth controller, uh, callbacks controller to handle all of that. Um, this gets to be kind of tricky because Im imagine if you logged in with your email address and then you tried to sign in with Facebook, well your Facebook email might match your uh, email that you already registered with, but we don't actually know if it's you or not because you haven't approved Facebook yet on your account, so we shouldn't log you into that account. Um, and so maybe you're connecting with some OAuth service that hasn't verified the emails of their users and then you might be able to sign up for an account somewhere else and then steal one of your users accounts. So we don't want any of those crazy things to happen. And so what we're gonna implement is a way for you to log in. It doesn't matter how, you can log in with Facebook or Twitter or email in this app and then you'll be able to add those other methods. So if you logged in with Facebook, then you could connect your Twitter account once you're logged in and then I would attach both of those to your account and then you'd be able to log in with either one. So that's what we're going to be building today. Now before we dive into actually coding up the controllers for all of this, I wanted to point out a couple things I've done to get us prepped for this episode. Number one is that I installed OmniAuth Twitter and connected that to Devise and set up the app ID in secret in our secrets.yaml in the exact same way as we did with OmniAuth Facebook. And so then for Twitter, I've also gone and created these links in our account page, which will show the connect link, which will link you to Twitter for the login process um, or Facebook if you haven't connected your Facebook. But because my account was created through Facebook, it's automatically connected. So then you can see these links here. These are the two. Basically, I just check to see if you have any Twitter services. And if you do, it's connected and then otherwise it's not. And same thing for Facebook, and that's as simple as it is. Okay, so our OmniAuth callbacks controller where we built our Facebook sign-in code before is where we want to implement the Twitter stuff, but we're also going to have to completely redo the Facebook method as well because we need to be able to do all of the exact same logic for both of these um, and any other ones that we would add in the future. So we've got a lot of work to do to refactor this. So what we're gonna do is open up a Twitter method down here and start writing out the logic. 